one of my arc short videos blow up and got 60,000 views and that brings a lot of questions about the video. I used rockets to destroy one of my enemy's motorboat on small tribes and some people said you could have placed C4s on that enemy motorboat. So in this video I'm gonna show you how to destroy enemy boats with turrets. Way back before I even started playing Ark, I think you could place C4s on platforms but because of how turrets works you could easily block their line of sight and destroy them and that probably made rafts unusable so they must have changed it to only being able to place C4s on your own raft and that made people to build thatched tunnels to clip into enemy boats which there are videos people raiding like this you place few C4s to your own rafts attach walls and clip into enemy raft and then blow it. but now you can't do this on official few years back this got changed too now you can only place C4s to platform's primary body you cannot place any C4s to the structures attached to them and this is why it's advised to cover your motorboat or raft with structures completely but you need to lower foundations to achieve that if you just place the foundations the low of your raft will be exposed and can be placed c4s easily I saw people found a way to lower foundations on rafts like this but it leaves the raft surface exposed when it's a full box it's okay it's not that bad but I recommend using just three pillars and also covering your driver's seat with another pillbox so you'll be extra safe this is too much work for stone raft builds but if you ever go for metal raft or metal motorboat definitely go for my design So, you cannot just clip into a box raft and place a C4 on their wall. You need to build a tunnel and rocket their wall. And then the rest is easy. One or two rockets for stone, five or six rockets for the metal. Then you'll collect the loot. Easy bullet farm. Also, the classic way of raiding is soaking the bullets. You can get a regular raft or motorboat and load up your stego and soak everything. And a little trick, place C4s on the ground and if the raft is too close, the area of damage might do enough to break through. But with turrets, this will probably won't do much. Since you can't place C4s while turrets are shooting at you, unless you can tank that. And finally, you can use a land dino that can move around really fast, also a little tanky. Place a C4 on the dino and land on the turret raft. The C4 splash damage should clear the turrets, but I think manas don't work anymore. Because when I place a C4 on them, they don't dash and they don't jump more than once. So for this, maybe shadow mains works better, you tell me. Alright, I think we're done here. Thank you for watching dear watchers and see you on the next video. Before you move on to the next one, I appreciate if you subscribe.